One thing I've learned about science is things are not always as they seem. Looks like physics is pretty popular. So what you want to do is try and pass it through it, okay? Oh, That's like... the important bit about it. Senior tutor Graham here in the physics department. This looks like an apartment where you have a lot of fun, am I right? Oh, it's a lot of fun in physics, absolutely. So tell me what's going on here. We've got a big crowd behind us because there's a couple of experiments happening. What are they? The one we're just looking at at the moment is, is the Van de Graaff generator where we can take the electrons off someone and we can cause them to be positively charged. And because they're positively charged, all their hairs stand out on end. They push away from each other. That's a pretty cool effect. Oh, it's a cool effect. Should we have and a go at it? A lot. We'll have a good go at it. Come on, let's go. Woo -hoo. On there, I'm ready. You're ready. I think I've got too much wax in my hair for this to do anything, okay. though. What do you reckon? Is it going to do anything? Here we go. Whoa! Across. A big blue oh. one. Whoa. Now it takes about 10,000 volts to jump about a centimetre, so we're dealing with about 20,000 volts there on that one. It's a lot of power. What's actually happening here? Tell us about the so physics so of this. Well, we've got a, a, a water mister down the bottom there, it's just causing the water particles to go really far apart, they're really small. And then we've got a fan above here that pulls the whole air up but also gives us the vortex okay. going on. And so what we've got is a, a whole lot of these very fine water particles being turned round and round very fast and being pulled up and it forms a, a what looks like a tornado. So tornadoes are just sort of spirals of air just going really, really yep. fast. Really, really fast. But they yep. can get and pretty uh, powerful though. In some parts of America they get tornadoes they, all the time. But well, tornado alley, we're pretty lucky. tornado alley down in the south of course get a lot because that's where you get in late summer, you get the late you get the warm air coming up and meeting the cold air that's coming down and that's when you get the real so dramatic the, the temperature dramatic change, yeah. effects of tornado early. This is pretty dramatic, although it can kind of be less dramatic when you just go like this. <laughs> and it's gone. Oh, and it's back. And it's gone. <laughs> okay, here we go. So out wide it's slow, sort of, and now it's gonna get faster. Oh! Whoa! So the closer you are, the more condensed your body is. The more condensed is. you are, the faster you're going to spin. spin. The yep. wider you are, you put your hands out yep. with those weights, the slower you're going to spin. Yep. Absolutely. Okay, you see the forces at play here, dear? This is the kind of thing I put myself through in the name of science, and you can't stop science. Although I'm going to have to stop now, or I'm missing you. Thank you very much. Good job. <laughs> and you see that magnetism is important for everyday life, okay? It's the way animals find their way home. It's using computers, PS3s, and everything.